channel if you're new here my name is Marilyn and if you're not new welcome back so today I'm super excited because I'm going to be doing a palette bingo and this time I'm going to be using two eyeshadow palettes and the palettes that I'm going to be using today are the Norvina mini pro pigment palettes volume 1 and volume 2 so I'm super excited to see what looks I will be creating today. So I'm going to be getting three shadows from this palette and three shadows from this palette. Okay, so this is what volume one looks like. It's super pretty, it has pinks and purples. So I'm going to put in my random number generator one through nine and generate three shades. So here we go, two, four, and one. Okay, so two is this one right here, which is a two. Four is B3, and one is A3. This is the first one. So these are the three shades that I have to use from the Volume 1 palette. Okay, and here is a Mini Volume 2 palette, and it also comes with nine shadows, so I'm going to generate three shadows as well. So here we go. I got three, two, and seven. So three is this shade right here, the orange one, two is the green, and seven is this purpley pinky shade. So here is the color story that I have to work with today. I'm super excited because these colors look very summery and I'm just super excited to see what look I will be creating today. So before I begin, I am going to be using the next pigment primer. And I'm going to be priming my eyes off camera and then I'll be right back. Okay you guys, I am back. I already primed my eyes and I did set it with a white shadow. And sorry if my face starts getting greasy, it's like super hot in here already. Okay, so I am ready to begin. So I'm going to begin with this shadow right here, which is from volume 2, which is this one right here. And I'm going to be putting this all over my crease. This shade is super pretty. Okay, now I'm going in with a clean brush just to blend out the edges. Okay, so now I'm going into the shade right here, which is the shade number four from the volume one palette, which is this one right here. It's like a pinky orangey shade or like a hot pink, I think. I don't know. I'm colorblind. But anyways, I'm just going to put it like in the outer V. Hopefully it looks good. Whoa, that's pigmented. So this pinky shade is like really pigmented, it looks super pretty. Okay, so now I'm going back with a brush that I use the purple shade, magenta shade, and I'm just trying to blend these two together. Okay, so now I'm going to be using this uh, orangey shade and that is also from the volume 1 palette. And it's this one right here, which is A1. And I'm going to put it like in the middle. I'm pretty sure this is the wrong brush, but I'm just going to be using it. Well, that's really pigmented and it's like a really light shade. Okay, now I'm going back into that this shade like the hot pink one and I'm just going to retouch this and blend it into that orangey shade ok 
and then I'm going back into the orange again. Okay, now I'm going into the shade right here, the lightest orange, which is from the Volume 2 palette, and it is shade number 3, this one right here, and that is a 3, and I'm going to be putting that right next to the other orange. So I'm just trying to do like a gradient type of thing, and hopefully it comes out like I want it. I think I need to change the brush. This one's hard to use. Okay, now I'm just gonna go back and forth from that middle orange and that light orange until they blend in together. Okay, so now I'm going to be using this green, and that is also from the Volume 2 palette, and it is shade number 2, this one right here, so A2, and I'm going to put that like in my inner part of the eye. And I'm going to drag it down my lower lash line just a little bit. It's crazy, I didn't think this green was going to be this pigmented. Okay, now I'm going into this shade right here, which is this one right here. And I'm going to put that on my lower lash line. Okay, so I'm going into this shade right here, and I'm going to put it right here so those two shades could blend in together really lightly. Okay, so now I'm going to be blending out the edges with this same brush that I used earlier. Okay, so now on to the last shade. And it's this one right here, and that is from the Volume 1 palette, which is this shade right here. And I'm going to be adding that in my inner corner, very lightly. Okay, I don't know if you can see it. It's like, it's like a yellow shimmer, but I feel like it doesn't want to show up on top of the green. But it is there. Okay, so now I'm going to apply eyeliner and mascara off camera, and then I'll be right back. Alright you guys, I am back. I already applied eyeliner and mascara. The eyeliner that I'm wearing on my waterline, it is a LA Girl Shockwave Neon Eyeliner in the shade Gotcha, and it's this one right here. And for my top liner, I used the Hank and Henry Blickety Black Liner, this one right here. And for mascara, I am using the Hourglass Unlocked Instant Extension Mascara, this one right here. And I actually got this one for free from Influencer. If you guys haven't watched my video, I will link it up here. And I also did a video trying out this mascara. If it's already up, I will link it up here. So anyways, this is the final look. What do you guys think? I think it came out really pretty and I'm in love with this eye look. I feel like it looks like jello or something. I don't know. Or I feel like it looks like the sherbet ice cream. I think that's what it's called. But anyways, I think it's super cute. And I think this is a perfect eye look for summer. And I just really like it. So yeah. I forgot to add lip gloss, so I'm going to be adding the Tarte lip gloss in the shade Flaming Hot. And this one is actually in my project pen. Okay. 
So anyways, I'm super happy with these two palettes. I'm really glad that I bought them. And the shadows are super pigmented. I didn't think they were going to be that good. Especially like this green one right here. I didn't think it was going to be this pigmented. And I'm just super happy that I got them. And I do not regret this purchase. So anyways, let me know in the comments below if you guys have these two eyeshadow palettes. And what do you guys think of them? Do you guys like them? So yeah. Anyways, that is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's fake.